Yo, yo, Daily Fire, episode 238. If it's trash, turn it off. But if it has value, please share it out for me. Of course, it's brought to you by MaxEffortMuscle.com for all your supplement needs. Go to Max Ever Muscle, Swig of Aminos. All right, Daily Fire, episode 238. We talked about this in the past, but I think it's something that's really good to come back to. And this is time thieves. Motherfuckers and the way you operate if you allow things, allow time to be stolen from you. A couple ways that time can be stolen from you if you don't have regs on it. One, your email. Uh, I really don't read my email until like lunchtime. That's kind of my plan or at least till I get to work, right? If I do it in the morning before I work out, uh, if I look at things, I can't, this is the way my brain works. I can't unknow it. So then I'm putting, you know, then I'm actually putting time into it when I should be putting time into something else. So I don't get to it till minimally nine, 10 o'clock. Social media, it's easy to get scrolling and just waste a half hour. I mean, real fucking quick, right? R wasting a half hour. So those are two things that steal your time. Number three, um, people that don't value your time will fucking steal your time all the time. And so I, I've gotten better at this um, as I gotten older, but I'll tell you what, that is, uh, it's hard to manage, but it's really important. So like, I don't think that I'm better than anybody, but what I do value is that my time has to be utilized properly because I got a lot of shit going on, including obviously family time, business, training, development like there's a lot of things that are really important to me and I'm trying to get time for all of them and so if you're wasting my time then you probably just won't get any time back ever and so I hate to sound like a super dick but those are things you have to be conscious of because once again this is the way I evaluate my time if there is not something that's being accomplished by this time, I could spend it playing football with my son, going to help my kids, you know, talking to my wife, like all the reasons why we work so hard so we can get time with our family. I could be using it for that. Um, shooting content. So it's like, I think people need to be real conscious of who they're spending their time with how easy they give it away, how accessible they make themselves. And if I look at my entire time strategy on development, on time spent with my family, working on my business, you know, trying to learn my craft to an elite level, like it doesn't leave a lot of time for what my grandfather used to reference, re refer to as dilly dallying. I'm not a dilly dallier. I don't have a lot of dilly dally time. I'm not um, a person that's not usually strategic about what's going on. And some people will think that that is in, maybe insincere or too aggressive. We don't got that much time on this planet. We don't got that much time to accomplish and do what we want. We don't got that much time with our family. You know, look, I'll be 44 this year. I'm halfway there, basically. So my time continues to just get more and more valuable. And so I really think that that's something I've known for a long time about myself is my value of time. I had a, um, a construction guy or my landscape guy one time. He was late for a meeting and he knew, like, I don't fuck with that. And he said, you're one of the people that I know values your time more than anybody. So he knows he can't be fucking late when he's when he's working with me. Because it gets it pisses me off, right? Because I got other shit to be doing. Um, so anyway, just evaluate it, understand it, look at it, and just know if you come out of a situation where you're like, I done wasted a bunch of time doing that, what could you view, what could have you replaced that time doing that have been better spent? Episode 238, Daily Fire. We out.